So today we're going to check out Nobody Wants to Die. The nice guys over at Play On have sent me a key developed by Critical Hit Games. And funnily enough, about two weeks ago, I bought Blade Runner's 4K edition. And this looks a lot like Blade Runner type of game. A, a neo-noir thriller with like cyberpunky futuristic setting. I'm pretty excited to try this out. We'll do like maybe 30 minutes of the intro. So to avoid spoilers for anybody that picks up the game. But it, it looks really good. So without further ado, let's jump in. Now when sickness or old age starts dragging you down, you can bid on a brand new body at your local government auction house. Give yourself and your loved ones a new lease on life and don't forget do you think that kind of thing will ever happen in real life you to download our consciousness into a new body so and carry on always avoid illicit substances never skip any mandated shell inspections we are running full settings 1440p physical psychological and especially with native rendering no DLSS. Any last subscription payments will result in your body being submitted to a bailiff auction. And remember, any and all violations but will I'm be this to look by the Department of Real Hotel. good. Oh, hello. Don't you already know who the murderer is? That's not the point. And at least tell me what's going on. Ooh, just watch, okay? Yeah. Just watch, okay? This is the best part. So it's very narrative-driven. Suspect. And when are you gonna question me? Want me to question? Unsure if these choices matter much, but I'm sure we'll find out. Ooh, kinky. Should I handcuff you? <laughs> Should I handcuff you? We always uh, handcuff suspects. I think you'd better. Sounds dangerous. I'm always dangerous. Too bad you didn't warn me before we got married. Would that have changed your mind? What if it had? What if it had? Where do you think we'd be now? I don't know. Maybe I... Maybe I wouldn't have... Huh? Hold up. <laughs> That looks painful. What a hell of a migraine. <gasps> uh, she wasn't real, okay. All units, code 305. Prohibition violation at intersection of... Breaking news. The president today signed into law a controversial bill reducing the age limit for free body subscriptions, despite earlier promises to the contrary. Fucking politics. Right, we can pick this little toy up. Rotate it around. Two-headed baseball dog, okay. We just turn the wipers off. Oh, that's awesome. The earpiece. Sullivan saved my ass more than once. His gun's got a name. That's a cool looking gun, though. How you feeling? Ready to get back in the saddle, Chief. I uh, sent you the papers. Oh, I know. I'm looking at them. Did you hear this? Fuck! What are you... Don't tear them up! Fuck! The accident was barely two weeks ago. Look, the committee already thought you were a hot mess. Trying to come back this soon? That's just got him convinced. You know fucking medical miracle, James. For old time's sake, about all that overtime. Mm, yeah. Chief, we've been busting our humps in the same department for half a century. You 
know I know this fucking job like nobody else. And you know I've got your back, too. Come on, Chief. You gotta let me come back. My hands are tied. Officially. Yeah? So unofficially, I'm all ears. Political case. Discreet. I'm listening. You'd be doing a favor for a guy whose signature trumps every test and commission out there. Oh, Mark, yeah. Yes! <laughs> uh, I owe you, Chief. Goddamn Get back in the saddle. In the walls. Not another word or I'll change my mind. Also, without your sync tests, can't get you back in the system. So I'm gonna put you with a liaison officer. She'll be the one with full access. A babysitter? Fucking hell. You asked for it, Sunshine. Wait, I'll put her on. <clears throat> what the? Holy hell. Whoa, look at that. Got that hologram there. A brave new world. So immersive you could drown. But of course, drowning is forbidden. Blocked like any other exit from paradise. That Cara? is James? awesome. Cara? No, fuck that. No way. Forget it, Chief. You're already on the line. James. Sarah Cott. Sarah. James Carr. Let me go pull some strings. Back in a minute. He dropped us into some bullshit, didn't he? And I had such good stats to know. Crap. Yeah, I'm fucking thrilled to be working with you, too. Uh, what can I say? Your reputation precedes you, especially after you fucked up half the city with that train. Yeah, I don't remember. I don't remember much about the accident. People tell me it was kind of a spectacle. You don't remember. So... What, you haven't synchronized yet? Chief Steiner trusts me. That ought to be good enough. Why is that kind of wobbling yeah, well, more so than the rest partner, of them? Right? Uh, sorry, boss. Hmm, suspicious. Forward the package to Karen. Look, you don't have to trust each other. Them stabilizers are going like bad. Got it? Steiner out. All right, let's get the show on the road. I need the address of the nearest post office. Fine. That girl in the hat overshadows more and more of the city, doesn't she? Sorry? Well, the one from the body auction ad? I haven't seen it. How could you not see it? It's on every goddamn corner. Looks like TS-45-7. You're in Times Square? It's the last place they play good old-fashioned crime stories. <laughs> yeah? You like watching how the cops used to do it? Detectives, not cops. Big difference. I'll take your word for it. Okay, movie buff. Go for the package. Platform 53D, Terminal 3. Roger that. <laughs> Get this baby running. This is cool. It's the spirit. Oh, let's take a sip of that whiskey. Nothing like drinking and flying. It's five o'clock somewhere. That's never gone wrong in my past. At all. Go on out of the way. Much better. I'm a cop on a mission. So 
not only is it visually very nice, the audio is really cool too. <laughs> Gotta have that music on for that movie feel. Okay, we got the package. Let's get back and everything will go smoothly. Now what's in this package? Badge. I miss carrying this lousy scrap of metal. Just don't abuse it, yeah? Remember, you're not reinstated yet. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, I got it, okay. You don't need to remind me. I'm just saying, it's my ass on the line now, too. This information is confidential and will be automatically destroyed after reading. Select a section to read the files. Hmm. Subject's name is Edward Green. Who? Hard to confuse this mug with anybody else. Okay, Green, Edward. Oh, shit. Sarah? You okay? Shit. Shit! Oh, I'm reading up on Green. Holy fuck, you know who this guy is? Relax. This will be a routine job. Routine my ass? What are we supposed to do? We get in, fully acarite, and deliver to the Consciousness Transmission Center. No sweat. You're telling me the Covenant Chief, the guy who used to be the Secretary of Health, his Icarites just lying around in a dead body? Fucking hell! Why isn't this going through official channels? There have been a scandal. Keep his name out of the mud. Ah, your you decision of affects if the, the story. Like so now we know. Fell into the wrong hands. Yeah, the fewer people know about it, the better. The atmosphere's tense because of this bill to reduce When she said Covenant Chief, exactly. she what sounded a lot said. like Cortana. I'm betting Green's I don't know if it's just because of yes, the, what she said. Motion of yours. Where's his body? Fifth Avenue, top floor. Looks like it's Green's own apartment. You'll get a chance to see the wannabe Olympus with your own eyes. Want to tag along? Uh, no. I'm not authorized for field work. You don't leave the house, man. Ah, we unlocked a new. What kind of question is that? I'm just connecting uh, dialogue. Okay. You haven't seen the ad that is literally everywhere. And you don't want to come with me. I already told you. That's because it's against the rules. And stop detective baiting me, or whatever the hell you call it. At this altitude, the air was so clean that without a smoke, I was beginning to suffocate. Just when I thought the game possibly couldn't look better. What the heck? This is a good-looking game. Shit. James, camera. This was supposed to be an accident. Fuckers hanging from the last cherry tree. What do you mean the last? Like, last, last? Mm-hmm. Let's pull the echo right and get out of here. Press caps to enter hint mode, but we we don't need no hints. This juice on the floor. Spillage on Nile 3. There was a pool of lesser than gel underneath the floor, feeding that big tree. Whole thing went up like a stick of dynamite. You can analyze his body. The right side of the body is more heavily charred. The tree must have exploded after he'd been hit. Reconstructor, hold Q or E to swipe over the yellow area in the Reconstructor, then enter the Anomaly Zone and look for more traces. Okay, this is cool. Oh my god. There we go. We fast forwarded to the point. 
What you got for us? Ooh, the goo's on the tree. It's flammable. It may have been a short circuit, or someone could have ignited it deliberately. I need to find the source. James, don't fucking ignore me. So that popped, caused the spark onto the gel. Hmm. Man, I'm really liking the mechanics in this game. Those character models are really good. Right, let's have a look. Oh, hello. Hello. What we got here? Ah, uh, the bloody footprint. Wait, there's a blood trail here. He must have gotten cut before the hanging. Do you have a UV lamp? Aha, there we go. Now where stairs. are you going? The usual shape. Like he was lying here. We'll solve this mystery, Mr. Green. Don't you worry. Must have been bleeding a lot. Oh, look at that. The tracks connect. Will you come back to me? James! Okay. Um, I'm sitting on the taking a poop. At home. You want more detail? Because I can give you more detail. Whatever. The feds are on their way there, so consider this a heads up. If they find you, I don't fucking know you. Are you... You're serious? We've been friends for fucking decades and you're gonna hang me out to dry? Alright, let's get this job done. Nobody will even know I was here. I'm gonna leave a mess up. Nobody will even know I was here. So I could leave a mess and they'll know or leave it tidy and leave. Okay. Let's leave it so they don't know I was here because um, I don't want any trouble. I leave the body of a dead god on the flaming Mount Olympus. Time to go back to the underworld he cast us all into. So I love that it's a, an old style detective story but in that futuristic neo-noir style Blade Runner-esque I'll leave it there because I don't want to spoil what this story goes if you decide to pick it up but I'm, I'm liking this it's very story driven narrative and uh, it's probably going to have some twists and turns through the way and replayability because of choices that you can unlock and decisions you can make